Welcome to today's Tech Byte. Today we're going to take a quick look at the Advanced Assembly Editor or Cabinet Editor. We've had several people ask us, well, what happened to the Move Parallel Line option that used to be in the old point system for um, shaping the cabinets? Well, it's still there, it's just in a different location. So I want to take you there and show you. I'm just placing a base cabinet on the wall and I'm going into the cabinet editor. I have it at the plan view so that we can look at it from the top. So let me zoom in a little bit. Hopefully you can see this a little bit better. At this point all I'm going to do is click on edit shape and you'll notice that now that we're using the what we call the advanced shape editor you have all these uh, CAD options that come up which give you a lot more control over each individual edge and the shapes that you create much more so than our old point system that we used. But I can understand the trouble that you have or the time that it takes to get used to going from one to the other. So in order to move a line in a parallel fashion just make sure that you've clicked on select then click on whichever line it is you want to move. Now you'll notice that the constraint boxes come up and the midpoint comes up. Well right here is a little parallel line and if you move your mouse over it it's kind of small. I understand that. But you'll get the, uh, a, a, in my case, a little finger pointing icon and I can left click there and just move it out and there we have it. And that's all there is to it. It moves the line in a parallel direction um, so that you can stretch it. It works if you like if you clip a corner on a cabinet um, and then you click on that cabinet you'll be able to move that clip in and out. So the move parallel line option is still there. It's just in a different location. So that's it for today. This completes today's training movie. I would like to remind you of your training options. The help files are available within each Cabinet Vision product. The eSupport technical website is a great resource for questions and answers and features a technician monitored forum. Regional training classes are available so please contact your customer service representative for the classes in your area. If you would like someone to come on site to your location and train your team, this can be arranged. Online training is a very convenient method for training over the internet. The e-learning training series is a series of topics which you can purchase online and download for immediate use. If you have questions about this or anything else, please go to our website, cabinetvision.com. We look forward to you joining us next time. Thank you for watching.